Hey guys, welcome back to My Divine Timing Tarot. Uh, this is a love reading for the sign of Taurus for the month of August 2022. Uh, we're going to look at what is going on with you right now in love and what will be the outcome for you in love for the month of August 2022. If this resonates with you, feel free to drop a comment down below and to like this video and subscribe to my channel. Thank you to everybody on here for your ongoing support. Spirit guides, connect me with Taurus in love and tell me what's going on with Taurus in love right now and what will be the outcome for Taurus in love for the month of August 2022, please, for my Taurus. What's going on with Taurus in love right now, spirit guides? Uh, we have the justice in reverse, the eight of swords, and the eight of pentacles in reverse. Libra, air, and earth energy. What will be the outcome for Taurus in love for the month of August 2022, please? Five of Cups, um, the Chariot in Reverse, the Two of Pentacles in Reverse, and the Hermit in Reverse. Virgo, Earth, uh, Cancer, and Water energy here. <clears throat> All right, Taurus, I feel like right now um, there's something that is not working in your favor here. You feel very stuck in this situation as well. Um, and there's something about you're not possibly willing to put in any more work or time into this situation. You're not, you're not, you don't, you don't want to put any more time or work into it. This person could have been dishonest with you as well, or somebody possibly is not being fair in a situation with you. So let's take a look. Spirit guides, clarify the justice card, please. Clarify the justice card for Taurus. Uh, we have the Eight of Cups in reverse. Even though um, this isn't working in your favor, even though possibly this person is being dishonest with you, um, there's still an energy of not not leaving this remaining in this it's like you feel very stuck in this uh situation or in this commitment you feel like there you don't you feel like restricted there's nothing that you can do to escape this clarify the eight of swords uh we have the queen of swords here I feel like you're just trying to really use your logic here. Clarify this Queen of Swords, please. The world in reverse here. Yeah, like there's... If you're not trying to use... If this is not your energy here, the Queen of Swords... If this is the other person's energy, I just want to put it out there that this person possibly, they could have been very direct here and said like, you know, we're not done yet. Like this person doesn't want to end things here with you just yet. It's like there's some sort of unfinished business here between the both of you or this person's just not ready to let you go. Maybe you know this person has been uh, lying to you. Maybe you know that, you know, uh, this person isn't being fair towards you, but there's an energy of someone here not walking away here, whether it's you or whether it's the per this other person or whether it's the both of you here. Uh, with the Eight of Pentacles in reverse, again, it's like you're, you're just, you don't want to put in any more uh, effort into this. Clarify the Eight of Pentacles in reverse, Spirit. Yeah, we have the Strength in reverse, Leo Energy. You're giving up. You feel so... 
drained. This person's really draining you out. You just feel like giving up here. As for your outcome, I'm seeing a lot of disappointments, a lot of sadness here. But I'm also seeing, I'm also seeing that whether it's you and this person, whether it's just one person, I feel like it's two people here though. It's like, no matter the stress that you're going through here, you're still trying to compromise here to be with this person. You're still trying to make compromises here to be with them. And it's like, you're not moving away and neither are they. Clarify the Five of Cups for Taurus and their outcome. The Wheel of Fortune here. And it's in reverse. Sorry, guys. I don't have any writing on these cards. I barely use these cards. So the Wheel of Fortune in reverse. It's like you don't know what to do here. You feel like you're stuck. You have no control over your life, over getting through this. And it's like, you just feel like you, you're staying in this sort of uh, commitment or you're staying in this situation. You're not moving away from it, even though you know it's very unsuccessful. It's not working out. Clarify the chariot in reverse. Yeah, the... The devil in reverse, Capricorn energy. <laughs> this is a very powerful connection. It's like you want to let go because you know that this is it, you know, this isn't going to turn out successful here. You want to let go, but you're not moving away. Clarify the two of pentacles in reverse spirit for Taurus. The ace of cups. You're compromising your own happiness. You're compromising your own heart, your own love. You're willing to compromise it all just to see this sort of work. Even though you know deep down inside this is not working. It's like you don't want to. Um, you don't want to be single. You don't want. You don't want to feel alone. Clarify the hermit in reverse spirit. Uh, the king of wands in reverse here. I feel like this is the persons that you're dealing with. Um, I feel like this is their energy, the king of wands in reverse here. It's like this person is almost too comfortable with you is what I want to say. Um, I, I, I keep hearing the word like, lonely like I don't want to be alone I don't want to be without you is what I keep hearing clarify this king of wands in reverse please the five of pentacles in reverse this person's never gonna like this person's not gonna let you go at least in the month of August here Maybe sometimes if you both have some sort of uh, breakup or argument, it's like this person starts to realize, like, I don't want to be without you. They could have, they could be a bit, um, I want to say conceited as well. Conceited in a way like, you know, like like they're using it against you, though, in that sort of way, if that makes any sort of sense. Like maybe 
what I'm hearing is like, maybe they might say to you, like, you know, you can't be with anyone else but me. You know, you know that you, you want me. You don't want anyone else. You know that um, I'm the right person for you. I'm the one for you. You're always going to miss me. You're never going to leave me. It's like they're a bit conceited. I don't know, Taurus. I feel like um, I don't see you separating away from this situation. I don't see this person separating from you as well. I want to see what the blockage is. What's the blockage in Taurus's uh, love life with this person, Spirit? We have the Four of Swords in reverse. I feel like the blockage is, is like you're not taking enough action here. You're not realizing things for what they are. Taurus. It's like there's some sort of wake up call that you're almost ignoring here. And you're not taking this sort of ac action. I don't know. That's what I have for you, Taurus. Hope this reading resonates and I'll see you guys again.